Quran tasks us as individuals to look further into science, to look further into understanding the universe. Well, I really prefer, if somebody wants to know about Islam or be introduced to Islam, I prefer that they first read about Islam before they go to read the Quran. Because the Quran is much different from the Bible in its organization and its approach and its, you know, so you've got that initial sort of obstacle, you know, that where it's much better if they have a context for it. Yusuf Ali was the Quran I read to start with. It, 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 his, um, his writing, his translation, is the one I've grown into Islam with. Now behold the heaven. It is we alone who built it with mighty hands. And indeed, it is we alone who are expanding it. 4751. What the Quran needs is more people in the West to see the content of the Quran and see the scientific verses so that that skepticism of divine revelation can be looked at afresh and people can understand that there is a holy book that talks to people and talks to modern science and says this is the way the universe is. The Quran is so much more than the other holy books before it. He created the heavens and the earth with absolute truth. He coils the night upon the daylight, and he coils the daylight upon the night. For he subjugated the sun and the moon to a perpetual order, each one traveling its orbit for a stated term, preordained by him. Most surely, he alone is the overpowering one, the most forgiving. 539.